Hi, this is Tim from milehighthemes.com. This is just a quick video acting as an addendum to showing us how to set up our group filtering in the Showtime theme. Shopify has made some changes since we created our original video, so this video will just show you briefly um, some of the changes that need to be made in order to get the filtering working now. So instead of having all the settings um, showing on the same page, we now have the sections support in Showtime and Shopify. So in order to get to those settings for the filtering, we first have to navigate to any collection page from within this browser. So in this case, I'm just going to click my catalog link and that will take me to a collection page. And now the settings have changed over here to show this collection settings area. Click that. And this is now where we set up our group filtering options from this list. And you still type in the names of the groups in the order you want in a comma separated list. So that's all the changes required there. It's just in a different location. And then as far as the menus themselves, uh, Shopify's menu creation system has changed a little bit. So as you recall, maybe from the video, you can create a custom menu here in order to order the filters in the order you want. So in this case, 0 to 25, 25 to 50, 50 to 100, 100 to 200. Previously, the menus were had a little bit different structure. But now we do the same thing. We create a new menu called price. Now we click add a menu item. And some people were getting confused over the links here. So you would still do zero to $25 here. And then for this, um, you can link this to whatever you want. It doesn't, the link is irrelevant for the purposes of the filtering. So if you want to just link it to home, or if you don't want to link at all, you can just simply put in a number sign in here, which basically renders the link useless. Add that. And you continue to do that, and then you can drag the menus around to order them in any way you want. So that should help with uh, some of the changes that Shopify's made as far as setting up the group filtering with Showtime. If you have any more questions, please don't hesitate to reach out to us, and thank you for using our themes.